Okay, so this is how you can set different lot size for each copper account. Okay, so uh, in this example, as usual, I have four MetaTrader accounts. So this first one at the top left from GBA Brokers, I will use that as a master account. So I will open any chart, I go to Expert Advisors, I take my server EA, and it just attaches to the chart. That's it. Master account is ready. It's already working. Um, now these other three accounts will serve as, as master accounts, copper accounts. Yeah. So they will copy all the trades from this master account. So I have a Darwin X account at the top, right? And that will be my first client account. So let me just open any chart. I put the client EA. I click OK. Uh, so I will go with the default settings for this one. OK, guys. Uh, for this client at the top bottom, sorry, bottom left, that's Admiral Markets. I will change settings a bit. So this is how I will demonstrate now how to set different lot sizes. OK. So this is, if you go to inputs, Sorry, it was a bit fast. So if you, you know, when you drag the EA on the chart or you double click it or use the attach the chart, it's like, you know, any way you start it, you go to inputs and then you scroll down a bit to find money management section. So this is where you can set what money management you want to use. In other words, this is where you set what lot size you want to use. We have a pretty detailed video on all the management modes that we offer. And as you can see, we have multiple of them. Obviously, I will not explain all of them there, you know, because it will just take too long. So there is another video on that. But uh, the default is auto adjust account size, which we'll just call AA. And it means so if my master account is 99,000 and my client account is 9,000, it means the lot size will be about 10 times smaller on the client account in this case. So it will auto adjust. We don't want the same lot size on, on an account that's smaller. If we go like 10 lots on the master, we don't want some lots on, on, on you know, on a $9,000 account. We want smaller. And uh, the outcome of a trade whether it will be profit or loss in percentage, it will be the same. So if you know if we lose one percent on the master with ten lots on this nine to nine thousand dollar account, we will have around one lot on the client, yeah, which is ten times smaller. So ten times smaller lot size, and we will lose it or you know win like to say the same. 1%. So this is how it works. We also have auto adjust and multiply. So if I choose this one, then this man management value is also um, taken into account. So if we, I said like two, that will be double risk. If I say 0.5, that will be half the risk. So the lot size will be even smaller. So if the master wins 1%, the client will win half percent, yeah? And uh, there's also same lot size, multiply and fixed and, the, you know, all the others. So let's yeah. say I want a fixed lot size. I will say, okay, no matter what, open 0.66 and I click OK. And for this one, that's Scandinavian markets, uh, I will attach client here as well. I go to money management and I will say, okay, use the same lot size no matter what, yeah, this master account. So now look what's happening. I will open a trade, 10 lots on this master account, yeah. So what's happening now, as you can see, these 10 lots turned into 1.09 on this 9,000 euro account. So it's 10 times smaller, but it's euros. 
So it's also taken into account the euro dollar currency rate. Yeah. So, and you can see it's 1.09. Yeah. So, so the lot size should be around one lot, but it, it just multiplies it as well by this rate. And e even though it looks like, oh, it's a bigger lot size, don't matter. You know, it's like it's the right thing to do. And in terms of percentage, it's the same exact risk as on the master, okay? Uh, now on this account, it doesn't matter. The account size doesn't matter anything. We have 0.66 fixed lot size. This is how we, you know, we, we, this is because we set that. And no matter what lot size it will open there, it always opens 0.66. Now for this account, we use the same lot size as you remember, yeah? So look, we have 10, we got one. Now we'll open three lots and it opens three lots. Now, because this account is two times smaller than the master comparing like 45,000 and 99,000, it means that we are risking twice as much on this client account, okay? but you know you as a copy trader and you're setting up so it's your responsibility to understand what you're doing and have all these um all these risks calculated and everything in place yeah um yeah let's see if we can if we can set something different so for this account right now i will set multiply by five point five, yeah. So now it will open twice a smaller lot size, always. So look, if I open two lots, sell, it will open one lot sell, yeah. And these others, just this ones keep opening point six six. This one, um. I forgot what, what do we have for this one? Oh, it's always the same. Yeah. So two lots as as you know, we have two lots there. So as you can see, you can change these lots um as you want, as you wish. And it, it's just a matter of risk management, basically, money management. Yeah. So I hope this helps.